I would be concerned with the folks we have in Washington of, of adding any tax or changing any taxes. We'll end up with both. Uh, they talked about, there was a guy that was with the uh, CBO, and I don't know if he was trying to warn the American people in my heart. I think that's what he's trying to do. Or if he just wasn't aware of what he was saying. I think he was a smart guy, and he didn't want to get canned or, or assassinated, so he was trying to warn the American people. But they were talking about the VAT tax, which was made in the news a lot. And he said, well, you know, uh, in, in order to, to meet the budget demands, uh, we would have to raise the tax on everybody in the whole country to between 85 and 97 percent. He said, and, and I don't think the American people would necessarily go for that. Now, that was the understatement. He said, so we're going to have to have like a 23 percent VAT tax. But in order for the American people to buy that, you know, we're going to have to say that we're going to at least look at cutting some things that are out there now. Now, I think he was a smart guy and he was trying to warn us that that's what they're doing because after that came out and it's like, oh, bad tax, we're not talking about a bad tax, we're talking about a bad tax, we're not talking about a bad tax, we'll talk about that after the election. Uh, but I think he was trying to warn us. Uh, I think that the uh, bad tax is a dangerous way to do it. They're talking about at each step you add uh, to it. Uh, I'm in the lumber brokerage business. I do a lot of sales at 2%. They're talking about a 5% bat. Well, you know, have at it, you know, I'll be retired. That wouldn't be a problem to be out of business.